teach you how to make a sugar scrub for your body, for your feet, for your hands, for anything. Uh, I recommend not using it for your face, but yeah, you can if you want to. So you'll just need like a microwavable bowl. Let me see the glass bowl. Coconut oil. You can get this at Trader Joe's. Yeah. And then just like brown sugar. Brown sugar. And then like a little container. It doesn't matter. You you can have it as big as you want, depending how much you want. I'm gonna make mine pretty big. And a spoon and a fork. So first you're just gonna take like like a bunch of your coconut oil. It, it's kind of hard to get out, so I already like got some out. And like, it depends how much you're making, but I'm, I put in like three to four tablespoons. So, that works. And then, let's get it all in there. And then, um, take your brown sugar. Mine is really hard and stiff. And take like a bunch of it. And to make your sugar scrub really nice, then when you grab a handful of whatever, then you're going to crush all of the all those really hard pieces in there like this. You want to crush it up so it's nice and smooth. And that takes a bit of time. But it, trust me, it's worth it. Definitely worth it. And then, you need like a lot. So, you can kind of squish it a little bit in your hands. Oh, um, you can, you can, um, it depends how much you're making, but I'm using, I'm kind of like, estimating, well, guessing, more like, um, I'm kind of guessing how much I need, but, like, approximately, you, you need, like, one and a half cups, and some people, they add, um, white sugar to it, too, but I'm not doing that, so, like, one and a half to two cups of brown sugar, to be exact, like, pretty exact. Now, just like kind of mix it in. Your coconut oil isn't going to be exactly like perfectly oil, so it's going to be kind of like, like, like not um, liquid. That is why we used a microwavable bowl. I'm going to take some of it. Ah. And, oh, that was hard. And then, like, get it all off your hands. Make sure you wash your hands before you do this process. Just kind of go like that. And then take it all off your spoon. Set it some down, down somewhere. And then pop it in your wave for about 10 seconds. dry out again so see now it's more yeah that makes it it um, gets harder easily. so then it's still like not a liquid so put it back in 20 seconds Ready to just like mix it up. At this time, you're going to take.
take out your fork and just like smush it so it gets all those little crumbs out of the brown sugar and the coconut oil. So with a spoon, it wouldn't really do anything with the fork with all the holes. It will do something. Okay, now I'm going to add a bit more brown sugar. And if it's too liquidy, then you can just add sugar as you go along. And then, um, and then you can kind of just mix it with your hands a little bit just to get all the brown sugar, like all these clumps <coughs> off. And that makes it come really soft. That's good. good and then you just want to get all those little little um, hard pieces of um, brown sugar out and then I'm gonna grab it. a little bit more yeah. it's kind of a messy process but it's it's worth it Okay, and then, okay, and then just go like this a bit more just to mix it all in. And then, yeah, once all of your little clumps, like, in there are all, like, all done and, like, smoothed out more, then... If you need to add any more brown sugar, you can do that. Because it doesn't hurt to add more. Just make sure you don't add too much. But it really does depend on how much you're making. So, you're going to get your jar out. This one you have here. I don't want to touch the outside. This one. Your little jar or big jar, or whatever you have. And then... You can either do it with your hands or with a spoon. I'm going to do it with my hands since they're already dirty. So you're going to take your little container and you're going to hold it over your bowl so you don't make a big mess. You can kind of like sprinkle it in there if you feel any hard, any hard, hard brown sugar. So yeah. And this one's good. But I'm going to take my fork again and just make sure it's all... Like, all not too, like, not hard pieces with all the brown sugar. Do that one more time before I put it all in the jar. And then, yeah. So, once you, you think it's the good amount of, like, nice and soft and good amount of brown sugar you have, then you can just pour it all in your jar. And it should turn out to be... A pretty good, like, pretty good, like, how much you make, and it should turn out to be good, like, good stuff. And then, um, yeah, so, if you have too much, that's okay. I don't want to fill, fill mine up the whole way, but I'll fill it up just some, because I have some extra in another bowl. So you're thinking like, why doesn't she have enough? But I have enough. Just pack it, kind of pack it down. And then, this is easy to clean up. So, just like, um, so for this, you can wash your hands off. And then, and then, And take some paper towels and this is easy to clean up it's easier than just washing it because you know it's all oily you can just get all the oil off put as much oil as you can off 
it's not too greasy. And then, I'm going to wash it. I'll do that later. But, now you have your, all your little sugar scrub. And now we shall try. So, just take like, like this much for right now. And then, like, just put it on your skin and you can, you can take a little bit and then, like, like, put it on your hand because it'll come off. Like, it'll go all over the sink and stuff. And then, grab a little bit more. Put it on, like, the top. And then, do it really, like, nice. And it'll feel really, really good. Yeah, not too hard, but, like, it'll feel nice. And then, when you, like, wash it off, your hands will feel super soft. Like, it's really nice. And, it works. and you can do this, like, in the shower with, like, your arms and everything. And then your skin will look all waterproof because, like, there are all those little drops in it. And then it's really soft and it's nice. Mm. Yeah. So, just dry your hands and that's pretty much it. But I hope you guys enjoyed my little um, sugar scrub video. Yeah. So, it's pretty cool. You can just like design it however you want. Like you can like put some construction tape paper and tape it on. And then like yeah. So it'll make it really cute and then tie a ribbon around. So that's pretty much it, but I hope you guys liked my video. So bye!